Hi everyone, this is Karen. So in this video I'm going to show you how you can extract all of your Silhouette Studio files to an external hard drive in one operation instead of having to save each file one by one. There are a lot of people who've been having problems with their files disappearing after updating to the latest Silhouette Studio software version. So this is one way that you can guarantee that you won't lose your files First you extract them, save them on an external hard drive, then you do the update and you've still got your files on an external drive or somewhere on your main drive. But as long as you've got your files extracted, you don't have to worry about losing your files. So I'm going to show you how this is done. So what you need to do is you need to go to a website called Ideas R Us Software. And I'm going to include the link in the description of the video below the video. So once you're on this site, click the downloads button over here and then scroll all the way down to the bottom of the screen and you're going to see right here it's called studio library file extractor and it is free so you just click the download button and you're going to save that file into your computer it's already put that here so I'm going to click the download link here and I'm going to click it now. That's going to install the soft, or that's going to bring up the dialog so I can install the software on my computer. And it is a Windows program. You may be confused a bit um, because you might see this screen from this menu at the bottom from time to time. That's because I'm working on a Mac. I have Windows on my Mac. So once you see this screen, click Next. You accept the agreement. If you do, click So, and then click Next and it's going to put it into its standard directory. You can just click Next. The folder already exists because I had already installed it. So I'm just going to click Yes. It's going to overwrite it. Then it's going to want to create shortcuts in my Start Menu folder. So I'm going to click Next. That's fine. And I'm going to have it create a desktop icon so it's easy for me to find that. So I'll click Next. So it's now going to install the program and it's done. So if I keep this checkbox checked, it's going to launch Silhouette Studio uh, Library File Extractor when I click Finish. Okay, so I have the program running now, and it's set to search all of my folders, and you can see that it has found 7,796 files. If I wanted to change that, I could do so. You can see that it shows all of the subdirectories in my library including fonts, different files, patterns, and everything. So I'm just having it search all folders, and I'm going to choose a destination. So I'm going to choose a folder on this PC. I'm going to put it into my C drive. I'm going to create a new folder. I'm going to call it Silhouette Studio Files Extracted. I'm going to click OK and it will put the files there for me. And you can see that there's an extract button here now, so I'm just going to click extract. And it's going to go through and you can see that it's processing all those entries. It's going to take a little while, but this is a heck of a lot faster than saving each and every single file one by one from the library to your hard drive. So once this has taken them and extracted them to your hard drive, your, your main root hard drive, you can then take those files, you can take that whole directory, copy it and paste it into an external drive, and then you've got all of your files on an external drive. While we're waiting for this to complete, I just wanted to let you know that you should sign up for my mailing list. I'm also going to include a link for that below the video. That way you will always be informed whenever I post a new tutorial with helpful information like this one. So we're almost done here. It's at 7,400 files. So that really has taken about five minutes, if that. Okay, so it's finished extracting the files. I'm going to click OK. And I'm going to close the program. I'm program and I'm just going to open up my directory. So this is on my C drive. And this is where I put the files. And you'll see the fonts are here. everything from my library. You can see that everything is here. It also includes previews. So you can see here are all those studio files. Everything has been extracted. Also, 
patterns are here. You can see there are pictures of all these patterns. And that's it. So you can see that everything from your Silhouette Studio library has been extracted to your hard drive. So what I can do is I can go up to this directory right here. I'm going to copy it and I'm going to put it onto my external drive, which is here. It looks a little bit different for me because again, I'm on a Mac. So I'm just going to paste it into this directory and that's going to copy all those files over for me onto my external hard drive. And you can see in the items remaining at the bottom here that it's going to take up about one gigabyte of space. So you just want to make sure that you have enough space for that. And that's it. So I hope this has been helpful to you. Thanks so much for watching and be sure to subscribe to my channel.